My name is Perry M, and um, I've been in the Boys Hope Girls Hope for about six years. One, two, three, go! My name is Bernard Brian Silva Jr., and I've been part of Boys Hope Girls Hope for five years. Boys Hope Girls Hope is a residential scholar program that helps underprivileged families get their kids to college and to good high school. My mentor, Cynthia Sanchez, she recommended me Boys Hope Girls Hope and told me that it's this residential program where they will help you with college and school and provide tutors and everything. I was always a smart kid. Like, I would get really good grades on my tests and stuff. I was really bad with my organization and I never did my homework. At home, I didn't have a good working place because it was always chaos. A lot of kids running around and stuff. My mom was single parent. It was hard for me to do homework and we didn't have computers and internet back then, or my mom didn't at least. At Boys Hope, they have computers, they have tutors that come and so it really helped me. So before, I wasn't really that good of a student, just good on tests. Do it. <laughs> Most of it was like visiting and hanging out with the boys, spending time with them, and then once that happens a couple weeks later, you get to stay like on a weekend overnight, and then you do that more often until you get a feel for the house and the staff get a feel of the student, and then you move in if you want to move in. So it was like nerve-wracking to just even think about not being with your family, because we're all so close. But then the decision was my decision. I remember the day when we first came here, like my first day actually living here. I remember my mom was crying and stuff and my stepdad was there and then my brother was there welcoming me into the house because he's been living there before. Who, Caleb? Por qué? Being able to be here for the boys and like just talk to them and tell them that like, hey, like I graduated from the program. I'm attending college now. Like, you know, you can do it. They know that they can come to me because I've been through that and know it's like hard to just get comfortable with this living situation, but if you stick through it, you can like, you can, it sounds cheesy, but you can do it, you know, like, it'll be fine. Harry is like a very, <laughs> Harry? Harry is chill. Harry is funny. Harry is a cherry. Perry, I mean, he seems really organized and he has his stuff together. I mean, he, he's going to school, like, he's had a job and he stayed committed to his job for a while and so, He's, he's really committed to what he does, and I admire that about him. So I've been chilling out with Bernard here, and we've pretty much hanged around for a really long time, and all I could say, he reminds me of my big brother. I know the boys look up to Bernard a lot, because just because he's like the older guy, he's graduating, and um, he's kind of, you know, he's almost done. They find him as a great role model because He's always doing his own thing. He's, um, he doesn't ask for much, which is, which is like good. I think Perry and Bernard are great, <laughs> honestly. If someone was to apply and um, was thinking about joining the program, I think I would tell them, like, I know you're afraid. At the end, it will be, it'll be worth it. And everything you do here will be worth it. The knowledge you receive from here and like the great education you get, will be like only beneficial to you. My goal is just, you know, to do good in college because it's going to be a new start for me. So do good, have fun, and figure out what I like to do and hopefully start a career in that sort of area. Well, my goal is just to finish college and then um, hopefully f have like a successful career and continue to mentor and help out the boys here at Boys Hope. So.